they always throw this stuff on, be it uh, McAfee or Norton or whatever it is, and it's awful. And usually it's always hard work to get rid of as well. They make it as difficult as possible. So always get rid of that stuff. Yeah. Anyway, got, got rid of it. Uh, went through the startup programs. If you go into Task Man Manager and find the startup option, it actually tells you the impact of each app. It says high impact, low impact, which is really quite cool. So you can see, you know, when you sign in, if it's taking two minutes before you can actually do anything, you can see what app is causing that. Mm. I went through uninstalled or disabled any service I think it didn't need, still didn't make any difference. And I'm stumped. I have no idea. Now, if I was there, physically, I would nuke it, reinstall Windows, clean install. But if anyone's got any ideas, what could be causing that performance hit? Because it's not just, uh, oh, this feels a little bit slow. It's, okay, this is ridiculous. I can't get anything done. You know, you're waiting five seconds for the start menu to come up. Sounds nothing, I know. But when you're a screen reader user, you know, if you hit tab and you're expecting to jump to that next button in a dialogue box, and it doesn't, so you hit tab again because it's not speaking, and then all of a sudden it'll wake up and do about four tabs in succession and you don't know where it... It just makes it impossible to use. So there you go. 